The purpose to find out if a homemade anemometer could tell the speed of wind based on the number of rotations. The problem is how many rotations can an anemometer get if the wind speeds is set to three different options. The question is how does the speed of wind affect the number of rotations of, on an anemometer? My hypothesis was if I set the speed on a fan from low to medium to high, then the number of rotations on, an, on the anemometer will be more than 20. The variables were controlled variables, type of cup, type of straw, type of glue, type of pin, the structure of the, the anemometer, and the type of fan, not speed. Independ independent variables, speed of the wind fan. Responding variables, the number of rotations. The materials were five three ounce paper cups, two drinking straws, a hot glue gun and hot glue, sharp pencil with eraser, single paper punch, a pin big enough to allow the structure to spin, a fan with three speeds, low, medium, and high, scissors, stapler optional instead of hot glue, the procedures were take four of the five cups and punch a hole about half an inch from the top rim of each of the four cups. Stick the top of one straw into the hole of the cup and, then, and glue them together. Put the cup sideways. Stick the other end of the straw into a, another hole in the other cup. Flip the second cup the other way. Repeat steps two and three for the other two cups. Take the fifth cup and put a hole with the scissors in the middle of the bottom. Stick, stick the pencil into the hole, eraser up, but put both of the straws made in steps two and three in a crisscross formation. Put the straws on top of the eraser and pin them together. Put the anemometer in front of the fan, set speed from low med to medium to high, and record the number of rotations. My conclusion was, in this project I created an anemometer, also called a wind meter. I predicted that if I said the speed of a fan from low to medium to high, then the number of rotations for each speed level would be more than 20. At the end of my at the end of the project, my results con concluded that my prediction was correct. For each speed level 1, level 1 recorded more than 20 rotations. At the end, I learned how an anemometer works. My application was anemometers are all over the world help people measure the speed of wind. It sometimes also helps Climatologist. climatologist predict the weather. My bibli bibliography was sign studies. Can you explain it? Like, how do I explain it? How is it working? It, like, when the, the fan is, like, spinning on it, like, it starts spinning, and mm -hmm. this is like how we count the rotations. Mm -hmm. And this is my table and my graph. You did the experiment, right? Yes. Uh,